you got first. Brian writes, hi team, love the show. What movie will you absolutely refuse to watch? If Steven Spielberg said, hey, do you want to come over to my house and watch said movie? Which movie would you refuse to, refuse to watch? Uh, for me, Transformers 4, Age <laughs> of Extinction, for two reasons. One, watching that movie makes my head hurt. It's a terrible movie. Mm. It's an abomination. Ellis it's a, got physically sick. It's, Ill. A, crime, it's <laughs> a crime against film, yeah. that movie. Oh, no. Two, Steven Spielberg is executive producer right, of that film. Weird. So you would go over there and watch yeah. it with him, and I'm not going to lie to him, but at the same time, I would try to hide my disgust with the film. I would just, you know, yeah. oh, is it good? Oh, it, uh, yeah, uh, no, i got to go to the bathroom <laughs> right now. Um, so that that would be for, for, for me. Christian? Well, if we're going to one of his movies, I the last uh, not the last crusade, uh, the Crystal Skull. We wouldn't be able to watch that with him. Uh, it would be tough to watch with him. Um, I could watch that with other people probably, but just not him. <laughs> um, I definitely couldn't watch Nymphomaniac one or two with him. It'd be really weird. Be watching it with your pops, <laughs> and then you look over, and he's like, "That's a good scene." I'm like, "Well, I'm out of here." Whoa, uh, close great. Encounters, and then you have, uh, and I think the other one would be either Freddy Got Fingered. You don't like Freddy Got Fingered? I hate it. And <laughs> and Irreversible is a great movie, but I. Watched it once, never have to watch it again. I don't care who is going to be watching it with me. I'm not I'm not watching Irreversible ever again. Josh? Um, yeah, I mean, we were talking about this before. If Steven Spielberg invites you over to his house to watch a movie, I would be like, well, whatever you want to do, Steve, me right. and you, just hanging out. But if he was like, let's get together in a dark room and watch Requiem for a Dream, I'm like, mm. I, I, you can't really do that. That's super depressing. Or if it was, but if you were saying one of his movies, listen, if he recommended crystal skull and i was in the room i would would have to really restrain myself from going over there and be like why did you do this to me mm -hmm. this is my favorite trilogy as a kid and you ruined everything you put them in a in a freaking refrigerator in a nuclear blast yeah. could you ever watch a movie with toby mcguire <laughs> <laughs> you have to bring that up here come on man Sinead, as someone who uh, has mentioned before that you've watched some uncomfortable movies and tv shows with with your parents what would be a movie that you wouldn't want to watch with I Steven have said Spielberg? that quite a few times, yes. huh? Yes. Like, don't you watch, like, Game of Thrones with your parents or something like that? Or something yeah. along those lines? Um, I think the big one was I watched the unrated 40-year-old um, virgin with my parents when I was, like, 12. Um, but, yeah, I know it's something we just happen to find ourselves in those uncomfortable situations. Mm -hmm. But Steven Spielberg. Um, no, I don't, I don't think I would... I feel like I would feel stupid. This is honest. I would feel stupid telling Steven Spielberg... I didn't want to watch a movie with him because I feel like he'd be like, what are you talking about? That movie is great. And I would just be wrong. <laughs> but, but no, what, what if he named something that was absolute garbage that you just, uh, you refused to, to watch? Like, what's a movie out there that you're like, I never want to see that movie again. You can't pay me enough money to see that movie. You guys, I don't know if there is a movie like you that. You can sit through anything, no matter what it is. Watch you, Irreversible. You are, that, you are that agreeable to the situation. Yeah. You'll sit through any movie. You watch, watch Irreversible. Yeah, I mean, I probably would sit through it. Yeah, like I, I can hate movies after I'm done yeah. watching them, but there's, it's not like in me just to be like, oh my gosh, never again, yeah. ever. I think a Serbian movie would be another one. Or maybe like porn. I wouldn't watch porn with Steven Spielberg. <laughs> yeah. Not, yeah, like there's a movie called. Space a, I think it's called a Serbian movie. I just I've heard a lot of things about it that just hearing about it. What's irreversible? I haven't seen this movie. Monica Bellucci. Um, it's it is a really dark kind of twisted film, and there's very graphic scenes oh, that okay. you don't ever want to watch again. Gotcha. <laughs> hey guys, if you like this clip, click here to watch the entire episode. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel because it'll help you stay up to date with all the stuff we've got going on here at Collider.